Social media is the most amazing source of free traffic, free leads, free revenue that the world has ever seen. So here's a plan that you can use to optimize your social media strategy. Welcome to ProfitCopilot.com. My name is Mick Meany and I'm here to help you get more website traffic and show you how to convert that into profit. So today I'm going to give you a social media strategy that you can take and use today to increase your traffic, increase your leads and increase your revenue all for free. Now, as good as social media is, engagement has been decreasing year on year and ad prices have been increasing year on year. It feels like the algorithm is rigged against us and the average engagement rate of a Facebook page is now below 0.17% and that is falling every quarter. Of course, social media networks want you to pay over and over and over again for exposure. They've broken their end of the deal. My trust in social media networks is at an all time low, but we can still use them and get free traffic leads and revenue from them. But we just have to be smart about the strategy that we implement. So I'm going to give you the seven fundamentals that you need to know for success on social media. I'm also going to give you an action plan that you can implement to drive free traffic to your website that will allow you to convert that traffic into leads and those leads into customers. So it's a really solid funnel that I'm going to show you how to set up today. But if you do want to dive a bit deeper into this, because this is such an in-depth topic that we can really go into like super detail step by step. Well, I've got that for you if you want it when you go to profitcopilot.com slash join. But today you're going to get enough to get up and running. Here's how you can get good results from social media for free. The seven fundamentals to a successful social media strategy are as follows. So the first one is to identify your goals, know what you want to achieve. That might be impressions, leads, sales. It's completely up to you. The second thing that you need to know is your audience. So we need to be aware of the demographics and psychographics. So you need to know their location, their gender, their age. You need to know their values, what they're interested in and their existing knowledge. The third step that you need to be aware of is building a solid strategy. Now this is going to help guide you so you know exactly what you need to do in each step, step by step as you continue to grow. Now the fourth step is to choose the right social media channels. And to do that, you need to choose the ones that have got the widest reach for your specific audience. And you can do that by analyzing the demographics and psychographics that we mentioned a second ago. And the fifth step that you need to implement is to create a map of your content plan. So this will tell you what you're publishing, where and when. And this is really important when it comes to outsourcing and scaling up because if everybody works from the same plan, you can quickly see what is working. And it also makes sure that the quality of the content that you're putting out there is of the same standard. That's really important. Then the sixth step that you need to do is create engagement. And this starts with triggering conversations. So we can do that by sharing content that resonates with our audience. And we know what resonates because we've already looked at the psychographics. We know what the values of that audience is. And then the final thing that you need to do is measure performance. This is really important because then you know what is working so you can do more of that. And you can find out what is working by looking at the right metrics. And that all depends on the very first step. If we go back to the beginning and look at your goals. So you decide what is important for you. So that tells you what metrics you need to be looking at. So you can have a look at page impressions, leads, sales, the conversion rate It is entirely up to you. So that's all the stuff we need to know. How do we actually drive traffic into our funnels? We'll have a look at this funnel that I've mapped out for you. So this is an action plan that you can use today. So what we do is look at the core content. So this can be an epic blog post, it can be a podcast video, doesn't matter what it is, as long as it delivers amazing value to your audience. So think about skyscraper content, think about roundup posts and interviews. And what we do is break it up into smaller chunks. And then we spread those small pieces of micro content out to individual social media networks, depending on the type of audience we're targeting 
and the type of content we're using on each channel. So we pick apart the content, the core content, and we choose things that we know will start a conversation with our audience. And we know what's going to start a conversation because we've done our homework. We've analyzed the values and the psychographics. So we know what people want to see. We know what will trigger their interest. And of course, every piece of content that we publish across these networks all leads back to your core content. And as you can see in this funnel, that's how we do it. We drive traffic through starting a conversation, grabbing interest, holding that interest, pulling people further into the funnel. So they hit the blog post and then they work their way down into the email sequence and eventually become a customer. And that's how you use social media. That is a solid social media strategy that you can use today. And of course, I delve deep into this when you go to Profit Copilot slash join. And if you want just traffic today without having to do any of this stuff, then I'm going to give you three traffic sources that you can use today to get more traffic for free when you go to profitcopilot.com slash traffic. OK, I hope you found this useful. If you have hit the like button below, subscribe to the channel too. I've got so much more content just like this for you. And remember to hit the little notification bell when you subscribe now, because that will notify you when I upload another video, which is going to be tomorrow. So thank you for checking this out. I hope you have a fantastic day and I will see you again tomorrow. Take care.